You know how when a girl turns 12 or when a boy turns 13 that then they're like bar mitzvah or bat mitzvah? Why did Hashem pick the number like 12 or 13 for that age for them to mature? Why is a boy bar mitzvah at 13 becomes obligated to keep the laws of the Torah and the girl at 12 because bas mitzvah and she's obligated to keep the laws of the Torah? The answer is that we know like we said before, the shaman we talked about tonight, the intellect, the main part of what? I'm saying, yeah, 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 right. So we know that the serving Hashem is through our intellect. We have to use our brain that God gave us to serve Him, and that's what we should use our brain for. Most people use the brain to serve their body, to find more enjoyment in life, and get more money and so on. And some people use the brain for serving Hashem. And uh, a little baby, you can't expect him to use his brain to serve Hashem because he doesn't have any uh, uh, idea what it's all about. As a person grows older, so their brain develops and they have more understanding of what it means of life is all about, what Judaism is all about, what the Jew is all about, what God is all about. And by the, time, by the time a person reaches the age of 13 of a boy and a girl who becomes mature faster than a boy, at 12, at that point, God says, now you have reached the uh, time of maturity that you are capable of understanding what's right and what's wrong, what God wants, what God doesn't want. You're capable of studying the Torah to learn what is, should be done, what should not be done, and therefore, not only are you capable, but now it is obligation on you. Since you've reached that point of maturity, of understanding, now you must go ahead and delve into the Torah, find out what God wants from you, and go ahead and do your best to do what you have to do. So the answer is that that's a point of maturity in a boy and girl's life where God says you have reached the point where you understand and you can dif differentiate between what's right and what's wrong. I understood the question correctly. She wants to know why did God decide 12 for a girl and 13 for a boy? That's the time of the maturity. No, I'm saying why did God make the girl mature at 12 and a boy at 13? Why those specific ages? Why not 17 and 18? Why not 9 and 12? Well, this is uh, something, the developing stages of a person. God, a person lives a certain amount of years and uh, he has to develop. We spoke about last week why people start off as babies and they develop into mature adults. We gave a whole reason for that. And uh, this is the uh, maturity, according to the amount of time a person lives, that God wants him to be not a, a person with understanding. Well, we gave a reason for that last time, and it's a, it's a, uh, a, a, a whole uh, a picture of a person's life. God made a person start off as a baby and to, to come to understanding, and, and at that point, is, is a t point of time to cut off where according to a person's life where he needs that lack of maturity and where he needs the, uh, the time of maturity for him to be able to serve Hashem best. Don't